Hello and welcome to vlog number 71. This week I'm going to talk about postural instability or balancing issues in Parkinson's disease. So what is meant by postural instability? Postural instability is a state of imbalance which gives rise to a tendency to fall. It is one of the primary motor symptoms of PD that tends to become apparent in later stages of the disease, making you unstable when standing because PD affects the reflexes and muscles responsible for maintaining an upright position. It may manifest itself on rising from a chair or bed, when changing direction by turning or pivoting, or when simply standing still and upright. As well as simply being a symptom of advancing Parkinson's, it can also be a side effect of deep brain stimulation or DBS. I have had DBS and I recently noticed a marked increase in postural instability following an adjustment that I made to calm tremor in my left leg. I'm not so out of balance that I've actually fallen over, but perhaps that is more luck than anything else. I find myself grabbing onto walls, chairs, tables and anything else convenient when I feel myself becoming unstable. In fact, the unconscious act of maintaining balance has been replaced by a largely unconscious tendency to position myself within a convenient distance of something to grab hold of if I feel out of balance. I can't blame it all on my DBS though. I remember my last two skiing holidays which were prior to my operation. I went from hardly ever falling over to hardly being able to remain upright which is kind of a prerequisite. I initially blamed my skis and my ski boots for my poor skiing. When I hired some newer skis and tightened up my boots almost to the point of pain and was still falling over, I had to accept that it was me, not my skiing equipment, that was the problem. Even with that realisation, there didn't seem to be anything I could do to counteract the tendency for me to lean backwards and thus be out of control and fall over. I'd start off making a conscious effort to be leaning forward in a truly exaggerated fashion and within 20 or 30 metres all of my weight would have transferred to my heels I'd be leaning backwards, totally out of control. It was at that point that I had to accept that my skiing days were over. PD patients with postural instability may experience symptoms in varying severities, which can change over time due to disease progression. The inability to maintain balance and recover from variations of movement can lead to falls, which can cause injury or death in people with Parkinson's. Postural instability is one of the most distressing symptoms, greatly impacting mobility, confidence, independence and thus quality of life. The exact cause of postural instability is not known. It is not thought to be linked to a reduction in dopamine but believed to be due to damage to other parts of the brain. Even though it is not thought to be a consequence of the death of dopaminergic neurons in the brain, PD medications that affect dopamine such as levodopa and dopamine agonists, can help to improve postural instability in the short to medium term. But their effectiveness decreases as the disease progresses. DBS is a surgical procedure that is thought to provide some benefit, albeit modest, for balance issues, although this flies in the face of my own experience. I have been told that physical therapy can be beneficial, particularly balance exercises, so I'm trying to get into the routine of using this balance cushion that I've been given. And also the balance games and exercises on my Nintendo Wii and balance board. And I'm hoping that this will help. I'm not ready for a walking stick or a walking frame just yet. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions or have a topic that you'd like me to cover in future vlogs, just leave me a message in the comments and I'll do my best to respond. Have a great week. See you next Friday.